Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm gonna be showing you guys how to bake. And no, we're not baking cookies. <laughs> no, we're gonna bake the face. Um, there is a million and one ways of how to do this, but I'm just gonna show you what works best for me. So if you wanna see how I bake, and okay, then so what we're gonna watching. do is take our powder, whatever you use is whatever you use. Don't mind this nasty t-shirt. <laughs> I just woke up and I'm doing my makeup. So I wanted to film it. Anyway, so yeah, you're gonna take any powder that you like to use. I'm using the Tarte Amazonian Clay Tinted Press Finishing Powder in the shade Fair. And we are just gonna take this and you're gonna use a sponge. I like to use a sponge. And I'm just gonna swirl this all around in it. And just get started with the baking now there is a fly in this room and it's so annoying okay and what you're gonna do is you're just gonna press into the face you're gonna press it underneath your under eye i'm gonna take it and just press now i'm using a pressed powder for this so it's a little different than using a regular um, loose powder because this is going to set a lot differently and it's not going to be as messy that's why I'd like to use a pressed powder instead not as messy at all And I like to go a little extra. Just because. I'm gonna go underneath again. I'm gonna do the lids just to set them. And yeah, I'm gonna do the chin a little bit. Just like that as you can see it's a lot lighter and then we're gonna carve out the cheekbones so what I do is I just follow from the top of my ear down as you can see and I like to do this first so I can use the line as a guide for when I contour and I'm going to show you that as well okay so I'm also going to put a little bit in the middle of the forehead just because I tend to get a lot of oil up there so there we have it itchy she knows okay now we're gonna contour the face a little bit I'm gonna take the butter bronzer by physicians formula and I'm just gonna follow that line try to stay in between the lines if you know what I'm saying something when we get in my eye every five seconds And I use that line as a guide because a lot of people like to do this step after, but I don't really like an extremely harsh line for my contour at all. I'm do the forehead as normal. down here as normal okay now that everything is set I'm gonna start blending away so everything is pretty seamless
perfect. And there you have it. This is like a quick version of how to bake. You can leave your powder on for a lot longer. If you wanted to, you could leave it on for five to 10 minutes. I don't really like to leave it on that long. I prefer just to quickly let it soak in a little bit. And then I like to just finish it off. And yeah, that is how I quickly bake my face on like a regular day-to-day -day basis. If Now, if I was going out, it would be a lot different. I would probably leave it on for a lot longer just because you want your makeup to last a lot longer. Um, what baking does is it sets with the skin and it uses the heat from your body to absorb the powder into your face a little bit more, um, if that makes sense. <laughs> um, but yeah, this was my version of just like a quick tutorial. Um, you don't have to use a pressed powder because it is a lot different with a pressed powder than it is a loose powder. A loose powder, you can use a lot more product. This, you're going to be swirling around a lot more than you would a loose powder. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this quick little tutorial. Uh, I just wanted to jump on here quickly and show you what I was doing for my makeup and I thought it would be a good opportunity for me to show you how I bake the face with a pressed powder. So yeah, if you guys have any questions at all, just leave a comment down below. I'd be happy to answer all your questions. Um, and don't forget to subscribe before you leave and turn on notifications to be notified for when I post videos, which is Monday through Friday. Last week I screwed up a little bit and um, couldn't post on Monday, so it had to be Tuesday through Saturday, but that's okay. Still got five videos up, so yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I will see you guys in my next one.